one from the field house here in Greensboro, North Carolina, where tonight the Swarm play host to the Suns of Northern Arizona. The first and only meeting between these two teams this season. Swarm 12 and 23 overall, Northern Arizona 15 and 17. Let's get a look at our starting lineups. First up for the visiting Suns in the backcourt, you'll see Booker and Elijah Millsap. Millsap has had a terrific year so far, 6'10", 215 pounds out of UAB, averages a team best 19 points a game and a team best eight rebounds as well. Xavier Silas can fill it up and in the middle, keep an eye certainly on their big guy. He's improving of late, says the coaching staff without question. Gracine Bakumania, 6'11", 220 pounds, and Alex Davis rounds out your starting five for the Suns. For the home swarm, seven and eight here at home, trying to get to 500 on the season here in the field house. And it will be an all NC State backcourt. Cat Barber, 6'1", rookie out of NC State, joined by Ralston Turner, the second year man out of the Wolfpack, 6'6", 205. Ralston Turner, Cat Barber, and Archie Goodwin will slide in there. The third year man out of Kentucky. Goodwin averaging a team best 17 on the year. Damian Wilkins and Cech Diallo round out your starting five for the Swarm. And Noel Gillespie, the head coach of Greensboro, brings his club here. Tenth overall in the East and fifth in the Atlantic. The Swarm have gone two and three over their last five outings. They did get the win in the last ball game, 113 to 105, a win over Reno back on the 11th of February. As for Northern Arizona, their head coach Ty Ellis here of the Suns. They are three and two over their last five. Interesting, the Suns got off to an incredibly fast-paced start. They started off the year 10 and one overall. But since that time, they have gone only 5 and 16. The Suns won most recently at Long Island back last night actually 119 to 108 so a quick turnaround here for the suns as they come in here both these teams looking to close out uh, this portion of the season before we get to the all-star break so they'll each get about nine ten days off before they get back in action and noel gillespie along the sidelines looking on he's seen a lot of turnover as you normally have here in the d league and has done a heck of a job here in the inaugural season keeping this group together Swarm will be playing, and Coach Gillespie playing without Rashid Suleiman tonight. Suleiman ravages 12 points a game, almost four rebounds. Uh, towards the end of the bench here, he's not playing tonight. The rookie out of Maryland, he's got a foot injury, and they hope to have him back after the All-Star break. Greensboro in their home white, and the Suns in their road purple. So glad to have you with us here from the field house as we get it underway. And the Suns will have it to start things off quickly to the basket. Straight down the lane for the bucket is Elijah Millsap. And can't get one early, earlier or easier than that if you are Northern Arizona. This is Barber, he'll swing it over to Turner. Catch, fire, three is away. Off the front iron, no good. And controlled by Booker. Booker hit ahead quickly to Silas. He's not shy, fires a three over the top of the backboard and we will go the other way. This Northern Arizona team averages uh, only 104 points on the year. That's 19th in the league. And Barber will bring it up with Booker draped on him, fell to the ground, picked it up though, and finds Diallo. Now Goodwin in the corner, aggressively to the basket, brings it back to the right hand, was looking for a foul, didn't get it. And a reach in on Wilkins, don't call, they don't call that one either. Millsap will push it, and a dunk down the middle by Gracine Bakumanya. Flexing himself, 6'11", 220, out of the Dominican Republic of Congo, and the rookie with authority to put the Suns up four to nothing. Bakumanya shoots 69% from the free throw line. And a 5-0 lead here for the Suns. Barber behind his back, he's got a mismatch now off the switch. Bakumanya on him, instead he'll swing it out the walk to Wilkins, working around the horn and Archie now holding. Looks to drive again, lost it, turnover, and the Suns will run. 
Booker in transition, flips it back to Davis, went up with ill intentions and is fouled by Ralston Turner. So a quick start here for the Suns. See the flip back and Alex Davis going up high and you see Turner got him right on that forearm. Good call by the officials here tonight. And Alex Davis, second year man out of Fresno State. 67% from the free throw line. And this Northern Arizona club that played last night in Long Island. Sharp start things off. 7 nothing, blanking the swarm. This is Diallo. He'll step in. Fires a long jump shot. Front iron is no good. Rebound pulled away by Silas. Hands it off to Booker. Barber on him. Now to Davis. Wilkins there defensively. Backdoor pass to Silas. Avoids the defender. Couldn't get it to go down. Long rebound. Comes out to Wilkins. Wilkins in transition now. Little stutter step. Steps back to Diallo. Diallo will drive. Slips by the contact. Can't finish with the left hand. And the Swarm still looking for their first basket here of the night. Outside, wide open. Silas for three, and it's good. Ten to nothing. Northern Arizona out in front. Barber off the screen from Diallo. He'll step back, fire the jump shot, good. And Greensboro is on the board. Booker comes right back at Barber, gets his own miss and finishes for two. His first basket, 12 to two. Greensboro trails it. Barber calling for a screen to help him get some separation for Booker. Swings it out to Wilkins. He's open for three. No good. Rebound down to Bakamanya. And Elijah Millsap left open. He'll fire three. No good. Diallo with the box out. Flips it to Wilkins. Head up. Looking ahead. Thought about flipping it up to Goodwood. Instead, he's going to keep it. Goes down on the right side. Basket's good. And he's fouled. Damian Wilkins. Tenth year man. Out of Georgia goes in, contact up high, and has enough strength left in the tank to finish it. Foul goes on Gracine Bakumanya. Picks up his first. Substitution for the Swarm as Turner checks out, and coming in is Perry Ellis. And here is Wilkins to try to complete the three-point play. And he does. Wilkins shooting 82% from the line. Barber will pick up Booker in the backcourt. Booker all the way down the lane, getting just too close to the basket. Couldn't finish it, got it back again. Flips it inside with a loose ball inside. Goes to Derek Cook. Fourteen to five Suns. Barber off the high screen. He'll fire the jump shot. Good. Barber has made two buckets here. Cuts the lead to seven. This is Millsap. Wilkins on him. Silas will drive in. Good defense by Goodwin not to foul. Barber the other way. Barber stutter step looking for somebody trailing. Couldn't find him and We'll see if they give him two on the free throws, if he was in the act of shooting or was he looking to pass, and they will say he was in the act of shooting. So free throws coming up for Cat Barber. An aggressive move to the hoop for Barber. Rookie out of NC State, scored 24 in the win against Reno. And just a 66% free throw shooter on the year. Gets one of two, 14 to eight. Barber has five of the Swarm's eight here to start things off in the first. 
Silas. And his pass kicked away by Archie Goodwin. Shot clock will go to 14 here. 14 to 8. Sun's out in front. Elijah Millsap will trot over to inbound it, trigger it right by the Suns' bench. Out in front to Booker and a whistle off the ball. And a foul will go on Archie Goodwin. That'll be his first. And the third team foul on Greensboro. Silas will flip it out to Booker. He's got a man on the wing. That's Millsap. Millsap with Diallo on him. Skip pass cross court. Quick ball movement by the Suns. Baseline jump shot by Davis. Doesn't get the friendly roll. Another offensive rebound opportunity, but lost out of bounds by Elijah Millsap. Millsap lost it. We'll go ahead the other way. 14-8. Wilkins flips it back to Ellis. He is bumped by Millsap. That's his first. And the third team foul on the Suns. Wilkins with Millsaps on his back, looking for a cutter. He's got him and a dunk. Pretty pass, pretty cut, pretty finish. As Archie Goodwin gets his first hoop. And once down 10, the Swarm will cut in to that lead. Trail by just four now. Xavier Silas with Goodwin there. Comes out front to Booker. Shot clock under 10 for Booker. Tried the little give down the lane, but Miss Davis turned it over. Here's Barber. He's got Ellis on his side. Flips it to Ellis, who flushes it home. And the lead down to just two now. Barber and Ellis hooking up. And a foul off the ball. Looked like Barber got snow plowed there by Suns player. Give it to Barber. We'll see if he's moving. He's kind of got tangled up and give that foul to Barber as he collided with Alex Davis. Bill Sapp lost it. Another turnover. Here's Archie. Flips it to Barber. So quick to the basket. Now, will they count it? Gonna get the foul and did the ball hit the backboard? Will be a goaltending call, so they'll count the basket. Barber's got seven points, and he'll go to the line to try to complete the three-point play. Foul went on Elijah Millsap. And for Millsap, that is his second already, and the fourth team foul on Northern Arizona. Millsap, the leading scorer and rebounder, 19 points and eight rebounds a game. And now we'll change the foul and uh, give it to Xavier Silas instead. So Silas owes Millsap a pizza there as he picks up, takes the foul from him, and Barber completes the three-point play. Good start here for Cat Barber. He's got eight, and the Swarm have their first lead here at 15-14. Millsap down the lane, he'll kick it out, deflected away by Barber, who got back defensively nicely there on the weak side, helped. And 13 on the shot clock. Josh Gray in the ball game, inbounds it to Silas, catch and shoot three. Suns go back in front, up by two, 17-15. Wilkins looking for Diallo on the inside, can't find him, left open, now trying to find Ellis. Ellis has got it, he'll drive in. Kind of lost it on the way up, and Gray the other way. Millsap working on Ellis, pulls up, jump shot, hangs and drops through, so the Suns answer after the Swarm had taken the 15-14 lead. Wilkins lost it in the paint, and the foul 
Comes from the outside and a reach in on Josh Gray and Ty Ellis doesn't like it. 5.43 to play here in the first, and we've got a timeout on the floor in the field house with Greensboro trailing Northern Arizona 19-15 as we take this break. Five forty-three to play here in the first, and the Suns out in front of the Swarm, nineteen fifteen. Both these teams getting after it, and the Suns started off ten zero and with authority. Takumanya down the lane, right over Turner, and Northern Arizona off to a quick start, but Greensboro has come back despite the flexing going on here by the Suns and. Cat Barber off to a great start. He's got eight of the 15 here for Greensboro. Rodney Williams on the court for the first time in number 24. He'll inbound it over to Barber. Barber looking for a screen from Goodwin. Now we'll give it over to Archie Goodwin. Millsap on him. Goodwin will back it out. Shot clock winding down. Goodwin will have to get going. Going to work. Lost it. Picked it up. Just gets it away. The Suns pushing it as they have the entire first here and the three off the mark by Silas. He was wide open. Barber had his pass kicked by Elijah Millsap, who got back defensively. Xavier Silas checks out. And Shaquille Harrison, 6'4 guard out of Tulsa, comes in for Ty Ellis's group. Silas taking a seat. Williams over to Ellis. Ellis on the baseline. Scoops to the middle. Comes back to the right hand. Wouldn't go down. Rebound falls into the hands of Millsap. Millsap hit ahead. Quickly to the basket. And a bucket by Shaquille Harrison. Harrison wasting little time getting into the act. 21-15. Now Suns. Barber from the free throw line. Short. All purple jerseys underneath. Elijah Millsap. Gets good one in the air, finds a trailer, gets it right back. Couldn't finish. Ellis knocks it away. Good one on the bounce with the left hand, comes back to the right hand and puts it in for two. Archie's got four, 21 17. Here's Davis to Elijah Millsap. Now Harrison. And a touch for Derek Cook. He'll face up and fire. Two swollen players had a shot at it. Stead comes right to Harrison. Now Gray drives in, avoids Diallo, missed the shot. Perry Ellis picks it up. Now to Barber. Barber had a notion. Now he'll take it. Missed the J. And Cook, one hand, rebounds that. Hands it back to Millsap. Wide open in the corner. Thought about the three. Instead, Harrison's going to take it in, draw the foul, and go to the line to shoot two. 
Well, Harrison only shoots about 24% from beyond the arc. And wisely takes it in, gets the foul on Diallo, his first and the fifth team foul on Greensboro. And Shaquille Harrison shoots 57% from the line. Left-hander will get two here. Northern Arizona perfect from the free throw line at 4-4 here in the first. Millsap will get a breather for the Suns. Coming in will be Michael Bryson. Harrison drops out the second. Swarm will spread the floor. Now Goodwin gives it to Barber. Right back to Goodwin. Shot clock under 10. Ellis comes his way. Goodwin will drive towards the middle. Goes up with the left hand. Couldn't get it to go down. Was bothered by Cook. Here's Harrison. Looking for Cook. Cook's got it. Suns are playing four on five. And a nice pass and finish as Harrison cleans it up. 24-17 Suns now. Took advantage of Goodwin who fell down on the other end and played five on four. Barber, nice feed to Diallo who lays it in. First basket of the game by Czech Diallo, the rookie out of Kansas. 24-19, five point game. And a timeout on the floor. Here with 2.49 to play, and Greensboro trailing 24-19. We'll be back after these messages here from the Fieldhouse. Two forty-nine left to play here in the first. The Suns have led by as many as ten. Uh, keeping Greensboro in it has been Cat Barber. He's had a heck of a first quarter, dishing the ball and scoring. Barber's got eight points on three of five shooting and two assists already to his name. And a five-point lead here for the Suns. Harrison with Prince Williams on him on the floor for the first time. Sean Miller also on the court. And this is Williams. Hands it back to Barber. He's got Josh Gray on him. 2.30 left to play in the first. Miller looking for Wilkins. Wilkins posting up. Spins to the basket, goes reverse. Didn't get it, comes back out. And draws the foul. Took it right into the chest and arms there of Michael Bryson. 
And a smart play by Damian Wilkins shows you why he's the veteran who's been around in his 10th season here, 6'6", 225, and just using the angles and using the body of the defender to get to the line. Well, they get a technical foul on Damian Wilkins, who must have said something, and so Gray is going to go back to the other way, and let's see what happened here. <laughs> well, that'll be a T in every book you look at, every replay you see, and I'm sure Damon didn't mean anything uh, ill-advised by it, maybe just letting the ref know that he's happy to have him here in Greensboro. Gets two from the line. Wilkins has five, 25-21. Here's Gray with Barber there. Flips it back to Bryson. Bryson lost it. Miller gets on the deck, flips it to Wilkins. Ahead to Williams, lost it, got it back. And goes Glass to kiss it in and draw Greensboro to within two. Defense turning into offense for Noel Gillespie's group. Under two left to play here in the first. And a defensive three second violation on Greensboro. Now go on Wilkins, I believe. And so Gray goes to the line, 73% free throw shooter. Squeaks it in, 26-23, Suns. There's Gray, Ellis switches out on him. Flips it out, three ball away as Barber closes out. No good off the miss by Bryson. Ellis had a notion, now he'll drive it. Takes it right at Cook and a foul. Goes on the 6'9", Derek Cook. One more time, Perry Ellis can put it on the deck. Takes it right towards the basket. And you see Cook, who went up, didn't go straight up. Leaned in, and that was just enough to give him the foul. And Ellis misses the first. 16 fouls on Northern Arizona. Ellis gets one of two, two-point game. Cook goes back door to Gray, had it knocked away by Ellis, and here's Barber. Gives it back to Ellis, flips it to Wilkins. Wilkins, Cook hits the deck, Ellis will drive it, goes to the corner to Miller. Back out front to Barber, shot clock winding down. Now at five. Barber takes it in, steps back over the goal, and let's see, last touched by Northern Arizona. And they'll put one second on the shot clock. Went out prior to the violation, so one second on the clock. Prince Williams will inbound it. Looks for Ellis, now comes back to Barber's side, to Miller, has to launch it, gets it away, and it's good! <laughs> Sean Miller flipped it up with the shot clock winding down and drained it. So count it for Sean Miller, his first three-pointer. And watch again, gets it away from plenty of time. High Archer drained it. Sean Miller, the rookie out of UConn. Gives a swarm the one-point lead at 27-26. Gray drives in. His pass knocked away by Williams. Williams collects it across the timeline to Ellis. Ellis 
Back out to Williams. Skip pass to Wilkins. Wilkins will drive and whistle for the travel. Maybe one too many passes that time by Greensboro. Prince Williams had a look at it. An unselfish ball by Coach Gillespie's group, but turnover will give it back to the Suns here. 30 seconds left to play in the first. Gray comes right at Barber. Couldn't finish. Big rebound by Miller. Now to Wilkins. About one second or so separate the shot clock and the game clock for Greensboro. Wilkins takes a peek over at his head coach. Gets the play call. Now 10 to shoot. Wilkins with the smaller gray on him is going to back him down and goes to the line to shoot two. Damien's so good at creating contact and getting to the free throw line. And he'll have two free throws coming up. Wilkins with five points in the first. Free throw was good. 28-26. Wilkins had 17 points, seven rebounds in the win over Reno. 29-26, four seconds left here in the first. Harrison's going to keep it, collides with the defenders. A whistle comes, and was it prior to the shot? Officials will discuss it here. Question is, when did the whistle come? So they'll come over and take a peek at it. 29 26. Swarm enjoying their largest lead here in the first. They'll review it, and when we come back to start the second, we'll let you know what they find. 29-26, Swarm come from down 10 in the first to lead it by three. One more look. Harrison, you see the contact. And it looks like the foul was whistled there. There was time on the clock. Look again. See Harrison. Miller's there. Williams is there. And you have to assume the foul came there with one second, maybe a few ticks on the clock. But the three man crew will continue to look. You be the judge. There's Harrison. The foul's there on Prince Williams. There's plenty of time left on the clock. The Signal from the outside official comes with under a second left. At 1.5 or so, maybe when the foul occurred. Phil. We come back inside the field house. And here in the first still, they're going to put 1.5 back on the clock here to close out the first. And have Josh, let's see, it's Shaquille Harrison will go to the line to shoot two here. So they put 1.5 back on the clock when the foul occurred. Harrison will shoot two. second this the second Miller's got the rebound to Wilkins he'll heave it length of the court off the top of the backboard and that will do it here for the first quarter 
in Greensboro where the Swarm lead it by two. 29-27 will take this time out. Back to start this second from Greensboro after this. Welcome back for the start of the second quarter here in the field house in Greensboro. Scott Perswanski with you. Greensboro trail by as many as 10 early in the first before coming back and they lead it here by two to start the second. Quick look at your first quarter stats. Swarm shot 10 of 23, 43 and a half percent, just one of four from three and the lone three was that heave by Sean Miller to end the shot clock and uh, got it to go down on the other side the sun shooting just 39 percent on nine of 23 after that quick start they really went cold and two of six from the line for northern arizona suns out rebounded the swarm 15 to 11. Good one behind his back, takes it in the paint, into traffic off the glass, no good. Rebound pulled away by Alex Davis. Suns can tie or take the lead here. Elijah Millsap back on the floor. As is Booker, he'll step back, fires a jump shot, foot on the line, would have been a two. Diallo away with the rebound, long hit ahead by Wilkins to Williams. Couldn't get it to finish. A little too much spin and the foul comes in on the Suns see the grab from behind that's where the foul was and it will go on Askia Booker and two free throws now for Prince Williams Swarm now 8 of 11 from the free throw line. Williams a 57% shooter from the line. And the second drops in, 30 to 27 Swarm. Off the ball, a hold on Williams. That's his second. First of the quarter against Greensboro. Silas and a moving screen goes on Alex Davis, who's in disbelief, but he really caught Archie Goodwin on the bump. Officials caught it second of the game.
Goldwyn resets, shot clock under 10. Now to Wilkins, Miller with a touch. Miller's got some size on the low blocks, but just ran over the defender, Xavier Silas, at 6'5", just stood in there and took the hit. You see when Miller just kind of lowers that left shoulder and pushes off some, and easy call by the officials on the charge. Millsap the other way with the left hand, got it right by Diallo. And cuts the lead to one. Millsap has six. Miller kicks it out to Wilkins. Wilkins looking for a check. Diallo can't find him. Swarm will reverse the basketball. Now to Williams. Prince Williams for three. No good. Suns can take the lead back with a bucket here. Millsap clearing out with that off arm. Scoops it up. No good. Got it back. Flips it. And the layup is good by Harrison and the Suns take the lead back 31 30 Shaquille Harrison off the bench with eight Williams finds good one cutting couldn't finish with the left might have lost it on the way up Harrison spots up Silas his three is no good Wilkins clears it away Swarm dodged one there of three seconds called on Northern Arizona. Looked like they got Alex Davis. And Damian Wilkins will shoot the one free throw for Greensboro. And we are tied at 31. Some substitutions now for the Swarm. Williams and Miller check out and on the floor for the first time the newest member of the Greensboro Swarm wearing 30 that's Devin Williams 6'9 225 out of West Virginia play most recently in Australia and a new pickup and happy to have Devin here in Greensboro Harrison checking out for the Suns Cap Barber back on the floor as well for Greensboro as Wilkins goes to the turnaround. He's in double figures for Greensboro with 10, 33-31, Swarm. Millsap steps back, hits the three. Only shoots 28% from beyond the arc. Looked good on that one. He's got nine. Puts the Suns back up by one. Barber trying to shake Booker. Diallo's going to keep it. Goes up. Tried to flush it home. And a foul will go on Derek Cook. Love the way. Check Diallo, the rookie from Kansas, aggressively goes to the basket. And two free throws on the way for Diallo. Averaging 14 points, almost eight rebounds a game. And drops them both in, 35-34, Swarm. Goodwin, Diallo, Williams. Barber and Wilkins, the five on the floor for the Swarm. Millsap will drive, can't get by Goodwin, steps back, might have been partially blocked. Diallo flips it to Barber. He'll spin into the front court, finds Diallo running, goes to the glass block, but they're gonna count it. Goaltending on Alex Davis, and boy, to check Diallo get up the floor quickly. Six, seven, he can run the floor, and Barber found him. Count it in transition, 20 or 37, 34 Swarm. Diallo has six now. Silas working and a whistle off the ball and a foul 
Goes on Devin Williams. His first. And the second team foul. For Greensboro. Alex Davis takes a breather for the Suns. Here's Booker. Nice find. It's Bakumanya couldn't finish. Got it back. Kicks it back out. Silas inside the arc. Shows some nice touch. Pulls the Suns to within one. Barber trying to set up Williams. Can't get it to him. They'll reset on this side of the floor. Now Barber squeaking by the baseline and goes glass for two. Just towed the baseline and got one step by the defender. He's got 10, and that'll be a push off and an offensive foul on Booker, who put Barber on his back. Askia Booker doesn't like it. He's complaining. And that's his second. Ty Ellis talking to the referees about it as well. 39-36 Greensboro. This is Barber, pulls up, jump shot, no good. Millsap away with the rebound. He'll bring it into the front court. Tried to drop it off to Cook and deflect it out of bounds as the help side defense is there for Greensboro. 7.05 left to play here in the second and a timeout asked for and granted to the Suns bench as Ty Ellis wants to talk it over with his group. Swarm leading at 39-36. We'll take a break here from the field house. 7.05 left to play here in the second. Three-point lead for Greensboro, 39-36, 7.05 left to play here in the second. It's been a tight first half, seven lead changes. Game's been tied three times, and we've seen a whole lot of everything here so far. The prayer answered by Sean Miller. Wilkins turning on the baseline, one of two players in double figures. Cat Barber, the other Swarm member in double figures. They both have 10 as Greensboro leads it 39-36. Swarm trying to go 500 on the season at home and get the win here, improved to eight and eight here in the field house. 14 on the shot clock for the Suns as we come back. This is Cook. Comes back to Booker, avoids the double team. Back to Cook, shot clock winding down. Booker will get going. Almost traveled and dragged that pivot foot. They don't call it. Ball hangs on the rim, scramble for it. Barber's got it out of the pack. Doesn't have numbers, looking for teammates. Wilkins all alone on the other side. Barber didn't see him, and now Damien's got it. Powers it in, off the glass, no good, and back to the line. Goes Damien Wilkins. 
Wilkins at the line here so far in the first half, a perfect six of six. As a team, the Swarm 12 of 15. That foul went on Elijah Millsap, and it is his second. First miss by Damian Wilkins, averaging 12 points, five rebounds, and three and a half assists this season. 82% free throw shooter. So goes one of two, and the lead at four. Millsap, Ralston Turner on him, just checked in. Basket good, and a foul on Turner. Lies in Millsap. Alertly going strong to the goal, maybe recognizing Ralston Turner just came back off the bench. It wasn't quite loose, perhaps, and an aggressive move by Millsap. Who gets to the line frequently for his club, sixth in the league. It's seven trips per game. Drains that one. Seven trips per game, I should say. He's got 12 points. Draws the Suns to within one. High screen from Diallo. Barber goes inside to Wilkins, kicks it out to Turner. Or check it, Mike Anderson, who's just come in. Shot clock at five for Barber. Barber will have to hoist it with two on the clock and Offensive possession, the Swarm would like to have back. 6.08 to play, and now the Suns can take the lead with a bucket on this possession. Booker breaks the pressure, throws the alley-oop, and a pretty play as Bakumanya flushes it home when the Suns take the lead back, 41-40. Barber, no one picks him up. Why not? Take it down, scoop it in for two. Nice stutter step by Cat Barber, and defense of help never came, and seas parted, and he laid it in. Swarm back up by one. Long three by Silas is good. Fourth made three of the game for the Suns, 44-42. Here's Goodwin. He'll drive it in. Scoop shot. Good. Count it. And one. Archie Goodwin. What he does best. Taking it into the paint. Scoring with contact. The whistle goes against Xavier Silas. For Silas, his second. Goodwin at the line. And now try to complete the three-point play. Archie with six points. Averaging 17 on the season. And that three-point play puts the Swarm back out in front. Millsap dribbles straight across the lane. Now comes back. Wants to go to that right shoulder. Didn't finish it. Goodwin out of the pack with it. Millsap on his back. Goodwin's going to keep it. Goes in. Tried to draw the foul. And no whistle comes. But the ball knocked out of bounds. Last touch by Askia Booker. Bakumanya will check out. And Shaquille Harrison back on the floor. 5.05 left to play before the half. Barber in the corner. Keeps it, shakes, fakes, comes back, reverse, had it blocked away. Good one's got the offensive rebound, sticks it in for two. Cook Jr. got the block, but Goodwin outdueled him for the rebound. 47-44, Millsap kicks it out, long three by Booker, no good, good one away with the rebound. He'll flip it ahead to Wilkins up the sideline in front of the Swarm bench. Now to Diallo, baseline turns, fires, good, check Diallo. Showing soft, a soft touch from the baseline, he's got eight. And the lead now at five for Greensboro.
Barber nearly stole that away. Booker's got it, shot clock winding down, and crossover by Booker and a foul with four seconds on the shot clock. Foul goes on Cat Barber. That's his second. And the fourth team foul on Greensboro. Booker and Barber have really been going at it here in the first half. And Askia Booker, second year man out of Colorado and a 68% free throw shooter, knocks home the first. Three points in the first half for Booker. He averages 17 and a half on the year. Drops them both in. Three point game. Good one has it knocked out of his hands. Good one will check out as Perry Ellis comes back on the floor. Wilkins airballed that one, thought the double team was coming, and it backed off and missed the shot. Silas quickly swings the ball to Harrison, goes in, nice jump stop, and finish on the opposite side. He's got 10 off the bench and a one-point game, 340 to go. Barber leaves everyone behind him, drops it in. Cad Barber with 14 to lead the way for Greensboro. Booker's going to come right back at him. Hangs in the air. Had it blocked once, twice. And last touch by Diallo out of bounds. And Booker really barking at the officials and complaining. He thought he was fouled. Fifty-one forty-eight. Shaquille Harrison will inbound it. Here with 327 to go in the second. This is Silas, and he stepped out of bounds. Gets a little tangled up there with Mike Anderson. And the officials want to settle things down. And Silas, with a smile on his face, will walk the other way. Fifty-one, forty-eight, swarm. Here's Barber with Booker there to greet him across the big Greensboro Swarm logo here in the field house. Barber takes a peek inside to Diallo. Instead goes to Ellis. Ellis lost it, turning towards the goal, picked up by Harrison. Harrison's going to go one on three to the basket with the left hand, finishes. No one picked him up. No one could stop him. And Shaquille Harrison have it. a solid first half off the bench. He's got 12. One point game again, under three to play. And a reach in foul on Harrison. A hold. That's his first and the 15 foul on the Suns. And we've got a timeout on the floor here in the field house in Greensboro. 253 left to play in the second. Greensboro holding to a one point lead as we take this timeout.
Greensboro leads it by one here as we are closing out the second. And Northern Arizona getting good bench play here tonight from Shaquille Harrison, who's had an array of moves to the basket. He averages about nine on the season. He's got 12 here in the first half. Harrison, rookie out of Tulsa, has been a spark for the Suns. As we come back, 15 on the shot clock. Mike Anderson, Perry Ellis, Czech Diallo, Cat Barber, and Damian Wilkins, the five on the floor. Anderson finds Diallo, who hand it off to Barber. Barber will keep it. Pry tried to get the lob to Diallo and last touched. Let's see. And they'll say last touch by a Suns defender. Initial call was to go the other way, but officials work it out. Five on the shot clock, though, for Greensboro. Anderson finds Barber, takes a peek at the clock, and he'll have to get going. Steps back, jump shot here. Shot it right over Josh Gray. Barber has 16. 53-50 now, Greensboro. 2.30 left to play in the second. Barber hits the deck and an offensive foul on Northern Arizona. It looks like Xavier Silas just ran over Cat Barber. That's the second time here tonight Barber's been smashed. It was whistled for the foul in the first, but gets the charge there. See if the Swarm can add to this three-point lead here. Barber behind his back a couple times. Gray not going away, though. Barber, jump shot, good. Cat Barber maybe feeling it a little bit. Back-to-back -back jumpers by the rookie from NC State. He's got 18 now. Harrison drives in, can't finish that one. Anderson lost it, and Harrison picks it right back up and finishes. Back to a three-point game. Barber, little stutter step, goes in, knew the contact was coming, hits the deck, shielded himself as Michael Bryson came over, and Barber will head to the line to shoot two free throws here. One more look at it. You see Cat Barber just kind of collect himself right there at the last minute. He knew it was going to be a collision with the 6'4", 200-pound Michael Bryson. And Barber makes the first free throw. He's got 19. And adds another. 20 first half points for Cat Barber. 57-52 Greensboro. Gray takes it right at Diallo. Blocked it with the left hand, but got a piece of him as well. And free throws now for the Suns. For Czech Diallo, that's his second. 15 foul on Greensboro as Gray, 73% free throw shooter. We'll have two coming up. The rookie out of LSU. Averages almost 13 on the season. If you're just picking us up here in the field house in Greensboro, the Suns got off to a quick start, led it by 10 in the first. Swarm came back, led it by a bucket after one and it's kind of been back and forth here in the second Greensboro up by three Perry Ellis goes inside to Wilkins Wilkins is posting up has been posting up with frequency but has that one blocked dunk and a foul Bryson had enough left in the tank after the foul to dunk it home with two hands and has a chance to tie it up as Diallo picks up another foul. There's Bryson and a reach in by Diallo and Bryson took off. Had enough glide left in him. And now can tie it up with a free throw. One. 
64% free throw shooter all the, the season. And got a friendly roll, and we are tied at 57 here. One minute left to play. Barber's going to pull up quickly. Missed the J. Rebound comes down to Millsap. Harrison, left-hander for three, no good. And a nice rebound hauled in by Mike Anderson. About 23 seconds or so separate the shot clock and the game clock. Wilkins turns the corner, kicks it to the corner. The three ball, good by Mike Anderson. Good find by Wilkins and the three by Anderson puts the swarm back up by three. Greenbrocher get it back here one more time. Here's Gray, splits the defenders, missed the shot. Ellis with the rebound, now to Barber. Ten seconds left, Barber goes the lob to Diallo, gathered it, lost it, turnover, and all alone on the other end is Josh Gray, who will lay it in. 2.1 seconds left. And Ellis to Anderson. He'll let fly from midcourt. And that will do it for the first half here in Greensboro with the Swarm holding on to a one-point lead at 60 to 59. So the Swarm come from down 10 in the first and they lead it here at the break, 60 to 59. We'll take a halftime timeout with you. When we come back, we'll have the start of the third here from Greensboro. Swarm lead it by one, 60 to 59.
Back at the half here in Greensboro, the Swarm at home in the field house leading the Suns by one, 60 to 51. Let's show you some of the first half highlights and certainly the Suns getting out to a quick start as they led it 10 to nothing early and with authority, Bakumanya down the lane, flushing one home and flexing, let, it, let everybody in the field house know that he was here. But off the bench, that was the story really for uh, Northern Arizona. Shaquille Harrison had a heck of a first half as uh, he led the way with 14 points. Millsap, the, a guy who we know can fill it up, averages 19 on the year, was in double figures as well. And in transition, the Suns were able to keep this one close and really prevent Greensboro from pulling away when they threatened to do so at times for the Swarm. Well, one guy has been on fire. It wasn't Sean Miller, although Miller brought the house down literally with that three as the shot clock was winding down. Damian Wilkins had a first half, uh, which had him in double figures. But again, it was Cat Barber who was outstanding. He had 20 points to lead the way on 8 of 14 shooting as Greensboro uh, was able to take the lead back. Archie Goodwin did good down the stretch. He had nine points and five rebounds, and Barber came up with bucket after bucket uh, when Greensboro needed a big one as they lead it here by one. Get a look here at our first half stats, and for the Suns, they end up going 21 of 47, so just about 45% free throw line, 13 of 15, and they out-rebounded the Swarm by 6, 26 to 20. They did turn it over 10 times in the first half thanks to Greensboro's defense turning him over for the Swarm. They end up shooting almost 49%, only two threes in the first half for Greensboro. And look at the free throw number, 16 of 20 for Greensboro from the free throw line. The Suns, again, they were 13 of 15, so a lot of free throws uh, being shot in the first half. Noel Gillespie's group did a good, good job taking care of the basketball as they only turned it over five times in the first half. Largest lead of the game for the Suns was at 10. Again, that came in the first. Swarm led it by as many as five and holding to the one point lead as we get set to start the third. From here, both teams will take a break for the all-star break and Greensboro will come back play again in the field house on the 24th of this month when they will play host to Maine and then they'll close out the month with two road games and then in March eight of their final 11 games for Greensboro will be here at home 60 to 59 the swarm will take the court up by one this northern Arizona group 15 and 17 on the year, just 4 and 11 on the road. And again, the only meeting between these two, two teams this year. Greensboro tasting on a West Foe and the Suns. The Swarm just 1 and 5 against teams from the West here so far. Second half underway. So glad you're with us here from the Fieldhouse, the Greensboro Coliseum Complex. Barbara will swing it over to Goodwin. Goodwin immediately goes to the rack, flips it over his head and in for two. What a shot by Archie Goodwin. He wanted an and one on that also. 62-59. Bakumanya feeds inside to Millsap. Nice high low there by the Suns. Trim the lead back to one. Millsap has 14. Goodwin looking to attack Millsap, lost his balance and the ball, and last touch, though, by the Suns, and so Greensboro fortunate there as Goodwin lost it. 
as he lost his footing. Mike Anderson getting the start for Greensboro here in the third. He's inbounding it. Subbing in for Ralston Turner. Barber can't get by the baseline. Four in the shot clock. Wilkins will have to launch the three straight on. Now the Suns with a chance to take the lead. Gray shut off by Diallo. Wisely brings it back out. Millsap will rise, fire for three, no good. Diallo away with the rebound. Now to Barber. Diallo with the ball fake. He'll go up with the left hand, left it short. And another try for the Suns to take the lead back. This three is no good by Silas on the offensive glass. Alex Davis has it. And he is fouled by Wilkins. That'll be the first of the game on Damian Wilkins. And two free throws will now come up for Alex Davis. Knocks in the first. Now three of three from the line. For the second year man out of Fresno State. And this one gives the Suns the lead back 63 62. Barber, nice give and go to Diallo, who rises and flushes it home. 64 63. Diallo in double figures with 10. Gray lost it. Scrambles, got it back and put it in for two. Anderson will fire a three. Millsap taking a peek inside. He'll go center court with it. Now to Gray. Posting up underneath is Davis. Now Goodwin gets in front of him. Gray is going to keep it. Left open for a moment. Fires a three. No good. They'll battle for it underneath. Picked up by the big fella. He can't get it to go down. Bakumanya missed it. And now the pack comes Anderson. Bounce pass to Wilkins. Wilkins with his head up, goes cross court to Barber, thought about the three, now will step back, baseline jump shot, wouldn't go. Good one battling underneath. And Josh Gray, Gray away with it, he'll keep it, goes up, had it blocked from behind, Bakumanya gets it and flips it in for two. And the Suns lead by three. Barber gets by Gray, glides, couldn't finish it. But will go to the line, and the foul on the shove by Josh Gray is his third, and that will put Barber on the line. Cat Barber in the first half, four of five. And swishes in the first substitution for the Suns as Cook will come in and sub in for Gracine Bakumanya. Barber had 24 in the last outing to win over Reno and he's got 21 here tonight. Two point game in the third. Gray fires one up, doesn't get the roll underneath. Finally saved by Barber. Good one had a notion, now to Barber. Diallo calling for it, he'll get it. Turns and faces on Cook, jump shot is no good. No 
Millsap away with the board. Millsap, pretty bounce pass to Cook underneath. Bothered by Diallo, couldn't finish it. Wilkins with the rebound. Goes into the front court to Goodwin. Goodwin lost it on the way up, but was fouled by Elijah Millsap. That is the third of the game on Millsap. And free throws are coming up for Archie Goodwin. But first, we've got a timeout on the floor here in the field house. As Ty Ellis, the head coach of the Suns, wants to talk it over. So we will break as well. Goodwin will have two free throws when we come back. Suns lead it by two here, 744 to go in the third. And Greensboro. Working a little pick and roll as Diallo goes down the lane. Off the nice feed from Cat Barber. Barber, who's got 21 points, drawing all kinds of attention. Everyone went his way. Diallo slips to the basket and flushes it home. Two shots now on the way for Archie Goodwin. Goodwin one of one from the free throw line and drops in this first try here in the third. He's got 12 now. One of four swarm players in double figures. And we are tied at 67. Goodness, Alex Davis from the top of the key. No one picked him up. And the 6'9", second-year man out of Fresno State shakes the rim here in the field house. Barber now out to Wilkins. He'll try a three. No good. And the rebound to Goodwin. Goodwin left open. He'll come back in. Slip. Kicks it back out to Anderson. Skip pass to Miller for three. That's no good. And here's Millsap for the Suns, leading by two. Davis from the left elbow knocks another one in. Shows you the dunk and shows you the jumper. He's got eight, 71-67. Suns lead it. Wilkins tried to draw the foul, didn't get it. And the errant shot goes into the hands of the Suns and a foul in the backcourt by Wilkins who I think is still pleading his case from the previous play offensively. And that will be the second of the game on Damian. Davis' pass taken away by Goodwin. Goodwin will challenge him. Davis goes underneath, and Goodwin goes up high and drops it in. Looked like Alex Davis might have been measuring Goodwin, but 
just couldn't get there in time. Millsap on the other side, and the finish by Derek Cook. Lead back to four for Northern Arizona. Miller with great position on the smaller defender, just turns and puts it in. And he had the 6'1", Josh Gray on his back, and Miller at 6'7". With a distinctive advantage, cuts the lead to two. And a turnover. As Silas tried to go cross court and threw it too high, and Millsap couldn't get there. Here's Davis with that little jab step jump shot, and then the one handed dunk with authority. And the Suns are up by two. Wilkins puts his head down, takes it at Davis. And here's Gray. Drops it back to Davis. He's fouled by Miller, and free throws are coming up for Alex Davis. Foul goes on Sean Miller, his second. And Davis will have two coming up. There were 35 free throws attempted in the first half, and it looks like that trend's going to continue here in the second as Davis is at the line, swishes in the first. On the air, Alex Davis averages eight points. Rattles in the second and a four-point lead. Perry Ellis checks in for the Swarm. And the officials will stop play just to make sure they've got the clock right. And we'll put 22 on the shot clock. working on the baseline and just too strong there and Davis gave up too much ground was under the goal and Ellis just flipped it in Millsap had a notion for three he'll drive in instead didn't finish it Cook's got it he'll back it out wide open gray measures for three no good good one away with the rebound Barber will try a triple gets it to go just the third made three of the game for Greensboro. Barber gives Greensboro the lead back by one. Good find by Goodwin. Barber had plenty of time and strokes it home. Game high 24 for Cat Barber. Harrison nearly traveled. Now we'll back it out. Try to drop it off and a kick ball. Wilkins who caught a brief breather now will check back in. Sean Miller back to the bench. And Alex Davis will depart for the Suns. Millsap drives in, shut off by the help defense. Goes to the corner to Shaquille Harrison. Jump stop in the lane and travel. Good team defense by Wilkins. And Mike Anderson. Comes for Barber. 
Both set the screen. Barber's going to keep it. Now back to Ellis. Swings it to Goodwin. Goodwin steps back, jump shot, no good. And Anderson picks up the loose ball to Barber. He'll try a straight on three. Miss that one. They'll battle underneath, and Goodwin takes it away. He'll go at the rim, fouled from behind. Good extra effort by the Swarm. And Archie Goodwin, third-year man out of Kentucky, kept after it. He and Wilkins on the offensive glass, and Goodwin will be rewarded with a couple of free throws. Northern Arizona pounded Greensboro on the boards in the first half, out-rebounded them by six. They had eight offensive rebounds to just two by Greensboro. Good one trying to make some up here on this possession on the offensive glass. 17 now for Archie Goodwin. The lead is three for Greensboro. Third quarter winding down. Harrison and a reach in foul on Anderson. That's his first and the fourth team foul on the Swarm. 14 placed on the shot clock for Anderson to inbound it. Check it, Harrison will inbound it. Now to Josh Gray, they'll reverse it. Millsap on the baseline. Wilkins on him, steps back, got some separation and a pretty jump shot by Elijah Millsap. 16 now for Millsap. Goodwin calling for Ellis. Gets the screen, draws two defenders. Now they'll shake away, and a foul will go here on Michael Bryson. As again, Goodwin taking it into traffic. Drawing contact and a reach in on Bryson. 2.40 to go in the third. Greensboro holding a one point advantage, a timeout on the court and we will break as well here from the field house in greensboro Greensboro holding a one-point lead. Here with 2.40 left to go in the third. Swarm shooting 45% for the game. The Suns just a tick under 44%. The team really scoring from the outside. Northern Arizona 4 of 15 from three. The Swarm 3 of 14. Greensboro comes in shooting just 32% from three. And Northern Arizona just at 33% from three. And 14 on the shot clock as Mike Anderson goes quickly to Wilkins, posts up and on the glass, put it right over the top of Michael Bryson. 13 points. 
for Damian Wilkins now. Harrison curling off the screen, wants to work on Goodwin, gets some separation, jump shot no good. Wilkins, quick rebound, touch pass out to Goodwin, just had too much on it though. Good idea, but too much heat on it. Three ball no good by Bryson, and Anderson picks it up one more time. The good one who dunks it home. Pretty, pretty pass. And touch on that pass by Mike Anderson, and good one who was down on the other end of the floor in the previous possession trying to run down the long pass. Didn't have a chance to get back, and so he was wide open. 82-77. Cook whips it inside to Bryson. Blocked by Wilkins, but Harrison picked it up. He can't finish. Harrison one more time. Kicks it out to Gray this time. Gray shaking bacon. Gets by Barber and lays it in for two. Josh Gray, rookie out of LSU, has 10 now. And a three-point game, 120 to go in the third. Ellis turns on Cook, sweeps through the lane. Runner is no good. Josh Gray puts on the Jets, goes in. Finger roll is good. Back-to-back -back baskets by the point guard, Josh Gray. He was right at his average. Now with 12 points and a one-point game again. Barber's going to go at him. Matt Cook off the glass with the left hand. 26 for Cat Barber. Gray feeling it back to the rim and back in the hoop. It turns and just stands and stares right at Barber. Now he'll back off as Wilkins goes ahead to Ellis. Ellis glides. And a charge will go on Ellis as he ran into the chest of Michael Bryson. And the fourth. Team foul on the Swarm. And the first whistle of the game against Ellis. About a second differential between the shot clock and the game clock. Josh Gray doesn't look like he wants to give up this hoop, give up this ball. He scored on the last couple possessions. Got to get going now with six. He's going to keep it. Gray all the way in, scoops it in for two. Josh Gray going back to back to back. Another basket. Goodwin lost it. And the Swarm won't get a shot up. And before the buzzer, let's see, they might have had a whistle, but here's Archie. Goodwin on the dunk for the Swarm. And then Josh Gray just decided to take over. Couple baskets going to the rim. There's one. Another look at the shake as he comes back to the right side. And Josh Gray with 16 points as the Swarm find themselves trailing by one, 85-84. Our score after the third start of the fourth quarter coming up momentarily here from Greensboro.
So after further video review, uh, the foul, the late whistle on Archie Goodwin will stand and we'll put 0.7 seconds left on the clock to end the, officially end the third. So 0.7 on the clock. And as it stands, Michael Bryson, they're just shy of midcourt, will trigger it. Gray turns, fires, had a good look at it, and shot is no good. And that will officially now end the third. And so we will break again. And 85-84 is how we'll leave it. And we'll be back to start the fourth here in a moment. One point lead for the Suns, 85-84 as we get set to start the fourth quarter. The Swarm shooting 47% for the game. And the Suns right around 44%. Four players in double figures for Greensboro, led by Cat Barber, who's got 26 points on 10 of 18 shooting, 19 for Archie Goodwin. Five players in double figures for the Suns. Josh Gray, after that late flurry to close out the third, has 16. Elijah Millsap with 16 as well. And Gray lost it this time, picks it up, but stolen away by Turner. He's tripped in the backcourt, and no whistle, and an unfortunate break for Ralston Turner. Let's look one more time. You see the scramble for it. Gray's got it, flipped it. Turner picks it up. And hard to tell from that angle if he got tripped up on his own feet or that of a Suns player. Catch and fire three by Silas is good. Fifth made three of the game for the Suns. And the fourth three for Silas. Sean Miller will kick it out. Turner will go right back inside to Miller. Turns, fires, and pretty shot by Sean Miller. Anderson matched up on Silas, drives it in, and five straight points for Xavier Silas. He's got 16 now. Prince Williams inside to Miller. Back out to Williams. 
Now to Ellis. Ellis lost it, gathered it. Half the kicks it out to Anderson. Two on the shot clock. Jump shot is no good. Rebound pulled down by the Suns. One more time and another basket by Silas. 93-86. Another three by Silas. So he's at a three, a two, and then a three. And it's 93-86. Turner to answer. Anderson on the offensive glass. Hands it off to Ellison. He's fouled. The foul will go on Xavier Silas. That's his fourth. And Perry Ellis to shoot two, but what an offensive eruption by Xavier Silas. Fourth year man out of Northern Illinois. Free throw is good by Ellis. Ellis ended his college career at Kansas as the number, as number eight on the all time scoring list and 12th on the rebounding list. Only the fourth Jayhawk player in school history to rank in the top 15. Both those categories, when you think about the stars that have come through Kansas and Barry Ellis leaving his mark in Lawrence. 93-88. Shaquille Harrison shut down here in the second half after such a strong first half. Forces one up there. Anderson ahead to Williams. He'll go up and dunk it home. Anderson's done a little bit of everything here in the second half after getting Extra minutes, played solid defense, nice assist there. Now he's matched up on Silas. Gray for three, and it goes. All of a sudden, the Suns are finding the range from beyond the arc. 19 to five, 19 points now for Gray. He'll go up, lay it good, and he's fouled by Ellis. 21 now for Gray. And an eight point lead for the Suns and a timeout at the Swarm bench. Well, offense, offensive consistency has been hard to come by for either club, but Northern Arizona erupting the Swarm trying to hang in there. Nice feet ahead and the dunk by Prince Williams. Right now, Greensboro finds themselves trailing by eight as they'll huddle up with Noel Gillespie as we take this time out with 9.04 left to play. The Suns have opened up an eight-point lead, 98-90, thanks to the hot shooting of Xavier Silas, who was five of nine from beyond the arc and taking it to the rack as well. He's got 19 points, and Silas has two threes here in the fourth. As a matter of fact, this Suns club made only four threes through three 
quarters of play. They've made three threes here in the fourth, already led by that guy, Silas, who's made two of them, and it's 98 to 90. And at the line will be Josh Gray, who scored 15 points here in the second half. And adds one to the total and a nine point lead now for the Suns. Go to the alley oop to Goodwin, but they're going to wave it off. And an illegal screen on Sean Miller. So wave off the basket. Goodwin, Barber, Turner, Miller, and Ellis, the five on the court to try to make a run here at the Suns. Gray kicks it to the corner to Shaquille Harrison, and another three drops in for the Suns. That's their fourth three of the quarter. 102-90, largest lead of the game for the Suns. Ellis will drive it in. Creates contact, had it blocked by Davis, who came over to help, and eight seconds. On the shot clock here with 8.21 to go. Good one, we'll flip it back out to Turner. Five to shoot, Turner launches a deep one. Good one on the offensive glass, lost it. Ellis picks it up and a reach in foul. Goes against Josh Gray, who's pleading his case, but whistle for the hack. The fourth foul on Gray. And a timeout at the Suns bench. A 30 second timeout as both sides will talk this over. So the largest lead of the game for the Suns, remember they led it by 10 early in the first. And this is the second time they've led by double digits here this evening, leading 102 to 90. And the threes rolling in for the Suns. They made four threes through the first three quarters of play and they've made four already here in the fourth. Put them up here 102 to 90. Josh Gray has 22. Xavier Silas has 19. The referees want to take a look at something on the uh, replay board. We'll look again here as Turner Frank the three, good one underneath, went up. Ellis has it, and maybe trying to figure out where the foul came, who the foul was whistled on and how much time on the clock. We'll look with you as Goodwin lost it. Ellis picks it up, Gray reaches in. And Alex Davis was there also. Go again. Ellis to the basket. Gray reaches in. Looks like he got him on the arm there. Maybe looking at the clock. And our group will confer now. And work it out. Again, the only meeting between these two clubs takes place here in Greensboro. They have ruled that Ellis was in the act of shooting. I believe that's what they were trying to confirm. So they give the foul to Gray and will send Ellis to the line to shoot a pair. And Perry Ellis, three of four from the line so far tonight. Swarm are 23 of 28. And the 
Phoenix Suns, 18 of 20. And one of two from the line. Suns outscoring the Swarm, 17 to seven here in the fourth, 102-91. Ray going to the basket, missed that one, follow dunk, no good by Davis. And the other way goes Goodwin, and that will be a goal 10. As Bryson got his hand in there. Aggressive move by Archie Goodwin. Davis goes at Ellis, goes to the left hand, and a soft touch by Alex Davis. He's got 12 and lead at 11. Barber, who's been quiet here in the second half, such a strong first half. He'll fire at long range. Three, got it to go. Not quiet anymore. 29 for Cat Barber. 104-96. Gray to the left hand, tried to bounce it to Davis and a kick ball. Three new faces on the floor for the Swarm as Wilkins, Diallo, and Anderson return. Millsap curled to the free throw line, shut off by Wilkins. Now he'll step into a jump shot, knocked it in. Lead back at 10. Barber to Diallo and mistimed it. Turnover. And Shaquille Harrison threw it away. Tried to find Bryson and Bryson was cutting and Suns give it right back. Ty Ellis, the sigh there. You read his expression. One oh six ninety six as Barber brings it into the front course. Front court. Six and a half to go here in the fourth. Barber, nice jump stop. Got the defender in the air and kissed it off the glass. 31 now for Cat Barber. Millsap turns and squares up on Wilkins. Spins to the paint, lost it. Picked up by Anderson. Anderson, middle of the floor, bounce pass to Goodwin, dunks it home. Anderson with a great feed, and Goodwin knew what to do with it. Check it out one more time. Anderson picks up the loose ball, he's got his head up, bounce pass, and Goodwin with authority. And the Swarm have cut the lead down to six. Timeout on the floor, five, 51 left to play here in the fourth with this timeout.
Six point game, 5.51 to play here in the fourth. Swarm is trailed by as many as 12 here in the final quarter. And that last dunk by Archie Goodwin gives him 23 points. Lead has been split in half. Barber, Anderson, Diallo, Wilkins, and Goodwin on the floor for Greensboro. That's his third. And just the second team foul on Greensboro. Millsap will go inside to Gray. Turns, basket's good. And a foul. He's got 24. Look one more time. Great. Quick spin move on Barber, and Barber got him over the top. And Gray. A chance at the three point play. He spins it out, and Wilkins has the rebound. Under 10 for Wilkins. Double team comes, finds Barber. Three away, no good, and Gray away with the rebound. Suns will run. Three on two for Gray. Down the lane, held by Anderson, and Anderson trying to say it was on the floor, but it will be two free throws for Gray. Two shots on the way for Josh Gray. And doesn't get the roll on the first. Gray has 18 points here in the second half. Second one falls through, pushes the lead back out to nine. Barber have really been dueling all game long. Gray has 25, Barber has 31. Wilkins trying to get some position, takes it up at Millsap. Bodies hit the deck, no whistle. Gray again, he'll keep it. Finger roll, couldn't finish this time. Harrison on the offensive glass. And last touch by the Suns out of bounds. Diallo from the right elbow almost thought about pulling the trigger. Four and a half to go. Barber will pull the trigger. Shot is good. They're going to count it. And where did the foul come? Let's look again here. See the screen. Off the ball must have been Gray and Diallo tangled up as Barber hits the shot. What the officials are going to look at here is to see if the shot was up by Barber and where the foul occurred in conjunction with that. So 109, 100, 429 to play, and another trip over to the scores table here for the officials to get a look at this one. Checking to see if they should count the basket or not. So here's Barber going up. And 
keep an eye on Gray and Diallo. And when the whistle or the foul is called, wasn't called early, and then the whistle does come, is Barber in the act of shooting or not? Another look, we're seeing what the officials are seeing, and Barbara curls, there's a grab, and keep an eye down at the bottom of your screen for when the official will signal. The whistle, 109-102 again, our score, and the Swarm would love to have a basket count here. Question about it, it was a foul on Gray as he was holding Diallo. And so the officials have seen enough and they'll huddle up and we'll get the call here from them in a second. The Swarm led this one by one at the half, 60 to. 59. It's a back and forth third quarter, and then Suns squawk a run thanks to some three pointers by Silas and nifty drives to the basket by Gray. They open up a 12 point lead. And now we stand at 109-102. So wave off the basket is what the final call will be. So we'll stay at 109-100 as the foul occurred prior to Barber's shot. And the Swarm will inbound it. Now will be called on Josh Gray, and that is his fifth. So the foul goes on Gray, and wave off the basket. Now we can get going again. Goodwin takes a peek inside, he'll drive baseline, finger roll is good. Archie Goodwin above the rim. 25 now for Archie. 109, 102, seven point game. Just over four to play. Millsap. Now to Gray. He'll drive on Wilkins. Goes up. Had it rejected by Diallo, but count the basket and goaltending on Check Diallo. Look again as Gray goes up. The ball ruled as it was on the way down. Good one. We'll fire a three. No good. Millsap clears away the rebound. 340 left to play. Millsap lost it, picked up by Wilkins. Swarm have numbers if they'll run. Wilkins kicks it out to Barber. Open three ball. Good! 34 for Cat Barber. And that cuts the lead down to six. Millsap to answer, and he does. 21 now for Millsap. 114, 105. Barber, one more time. Got it! And a foul! And the foul will go on Diallo. 
they'll give it to Diallo instead of Gray and wave off the basket. So wave it off. Offensive foul on Diallo and we'll stay at 114-105. Millsap will drive. Wilkins knocked it out of his hands. And the 114-105 Millsap will drive. Wilkins knocked it out of his hands. And they'll say last to have that one reviewed and see if in fact it went off a Greensboro player or a Suns player. So 249. I'll tell you, our replay folks have been just as busy as anybody here tonight. One more time, the officials will come over and put the headset on and check it out. Look again, here's Millsap, drives in, knocked off his leg. Looked like Davis picked it up there. And a block from that vantage point. So let's see, maybe we can tell from this angle. Again, the drive by Millsap. Ball knocked off his leg. Touched by a Suns player in the corner. Now, did Anderson touch it or not? After the fact, let's see here. Touched by the Suns player right there. Anderson is leaning in, and from that angle, it doesn't look like he had a hand on it at all, but this should show us here. Well. Officials feel like they've seen it up. And 249 left to play. And you see the group conferring here at midcourt. And we'll see what they come up with here, but. So they'll overturn the call and uh, rule that it was last touched by the Swarm. And so good call there by Coach Gillespie and staff to have them relook at that one. So Diallo, Barber, Anderson, Goodwin, and Wilkins, the five on the court. 2.49 to go. 114-105. Barber will come back out front to Goodwin, and he traveled. Shuffled his feet, couldn't quite decide if he wanted to pull the trigger on the long-range jumper or drive to the basket. Got caught in between, and a turnover gives it right back here with 240 to go. Barber will pick up in the backcourt on Josh Gray. Hands it off to Silas. Now Millsap. Back to Gray. And Harrison down the lane tried to come back inside and threw it away. Tried to find Alex Davis curling and gave it right back. So the door still open for the swarm. Barber finds Diallo, slams it with one hand. Nice slip to the basket by Diallo. Seven point lead now for the Suns. Gray drives in over the outstretched arms of the defender. And Gray's been spectacular here in the second half. Wilkins to answer, he's wrapped up by Millsap. And Wilkins telling everyone he was in the act of shooting. Going to give it to the veteran. Fourth foul on Millsap. Look again as Diallo slips to the basket. Barber hit him right in the hands and Check knew what to do with it. Two.
Two minutes left to play. Harbor trying to break free. No switch, Millsap comes out on him. Barber jetting around everyone. Goes glass for two more. Cat Barber with 36. 116, 109, and a timeout at the Suns bench. Look at Barber, gets away from one defender, second defender, steps by Gray and goes glass for two more. Coach Gillespie will talk it over as the lead one more time down to seven. Look at Barber's line. He is 14 of 23. Three of five from beyond the arc. Five of seven from the free throw line. 36 points and five assists as well. Cat Barber. Now, can the Swarm get a stop on this end? Here's Gray. He's been equally as impressive with 29 points. He'll keep it, goes in, and draws a foul on Diallo, who's didn't like that call. That's the fifth of the game on Diallo. And Gray misses the free throw. Now six of eight from the line for Gray. Got 23 here in the second half. I'll give him 24 in the second half and 30 for the game. And a foul will go on Gray, and that will be six. So he's done. And a foul way away from the basket on Josh Gray will send him to the bench and he'll leave with a team high 30 points 24 coming here in the second half but his team leading 117 to 109 133 to go Ty Ellis will see who he pulls from his bench, and he'll bring in Derek Cook. So he'll go big, bringing in the 6'9 Cook. Millsap will move over now and guard Barber. Wilkins will take it near the right block, kicks it out. Goodwin will drive in, gets the defenders in the air, and draws the foul. So the clock stops. Foul goes on Derek Cook and Archie Goodwin. We'll have two coming up here. Goodwin at the line is five of five from the free throw line. Knocks in another. He's got 26 now. As a team, the Swarm, 25 of 31 from the line. Goodwin rolls in them both. Two-possession game now. Anderson, a few paces off of Millsap. Takes a peek up at the shot clock. It's at 10 now. Millsap still with the bounce. Avoids the screen, goes in, kicks it out. Silas for three, no good. Rebound pulled by Diallo, ahead to Goodwin, who snuck down the court, layup is good! And he's fouled! Watch the outlet by Diallo, no hesitation. The reach in on Goodwin, the concentration by Goodwin, and the basket 
by Goodwin, 117 to 113. And Goodwin with a chance to complete the three-point play. And missed it. His first miss from the line tonight. Barber pressing up on Millsap. Millsap really using that off arm to get some separation. Missed the shot. Goodwin's got it. 35 seconds left. Pass inside to Diallo. Knocked away and a foul. Will go on the Suns. <laughs> and Wilkins, one of the calls, saying he was in the act of shooting a three. Takes a seat in the front row. <laughs> Says, I'm a veteran. I'm supposed to get that call, aren't I? But he'll go to the line to shoot two, though. And two big free throws now for Wilkins, who is seven of eight tonight. Knocks in the first. About seven seconds separate the shot clock and the game clock. As Wilkins makes a pair. Two-point game, 31 seconds left. Swarm will look to get a stop and play without fouling here. Where will the Suns go? With Gray out of the game. Silas has it. Open, free throw line, jump shot is good. Silas with 21 and a four-point lead now for the Suns. Xavier Silas got the defense moving backwards. He held up with the jump stop. Hit the J, and it's 119-115. 13 seconds left here in the field house in Greensboro. Swarm had just cut it to two off the free throws by Damian Wilkins. And now no Gillespie will Try to chalk up a quick bucket in his huddle. Swarm with one timeout left. Suns with one timeout as well. Archie Goodwin has 29. Pat Barber with 36. It will be Anderson, Diallo, Wilkins, Goodwin and Barber. Xavier Silas with a big jumper to put him up by four. Anderson looking for Barber. Have to go to the corner to Wilkins and he didn't get it in bounds. Five second call and Anderson didn't get it in bounds. He was trying to wait for the play to develop. Costly, costly turnover for the Swarm. Millsap's got it, and he's quickly fouled by Goodwin. And Elijah Millsap is a 72% free throw shooter. And he'll stroll down to the other side to shoot two. Millsap is one of two from the line. First one away and, and gets the friendly roll. 22 for Millsap, who averages 19 on the season. And a six point lead for the Suns, and another timeout by Greensboro. Again, the 
Baltimore. We'll take a break for the All-Star game and be back home for their next game, the 24th year of February when they will host Maine and close out the month of February with two road games. And Greensboro will be back home in the field house where eight of their final 11 games will be in this building. But a two possession game here with 11.9 left to play. And Suns pushed the lead out to 12. Greensboro came back, cut it down to two with 31 seconds left. Couldn't get that one stop as Xavier Silas shot the free throw line jumper. Need a quick hitter here. Give it to Wilkins. Wilkins back to Barber. Barber will drive in with the left hand. It's good. 121-117. 6.8 left. And a foul quickly by Anderson. And Xavier Silas, who shoots almost 84% from the line, takes a couple practice strokes as he walks towards the free throw line. And now we'll have two here. First one away and gets the roll. And drops in the second. He's got 23 now. Now Barber to inbound it. So 123 to 117. And barring a miracle, the Suns will get the road win here in Greensboro. Wilkins will fire it. And a foul is called on Cook. Shooting a three. Wow. And Wilkins will have three free throws coming up with 3.9 seconds left. top of the towards the top of your screen you might be able to see Ty Ellis there the head coach of the Suns who's put his hands in his pockets and is just in disbelief at what just occurred but Wilkins misses the first drops in the second we'll have one more Sean Miller will come in Subs in for Mike Anderson. And 3.9 left. And the Swarm trailing by five. This is on purpose. There's good one down the lane, and he tips it in. And a three-point game with 3.6 left. So a set play and the miss by Wilkins, and good one. Streaks down the lane, and we have a one possession game. So maybe we will have that miracle. One timeout left for the Suns. Swarm don't have any. Harrison gets it inbound and inbounds, and quickly Millsap is fouled. Here with 2.6 left. Millsap, 72% free throw shooter. And knocks in the first. And two possession game now and clutch free throws here by Elijah Millsap. As he drops them both in. 125-120. A swarm made it interesting here down the stretch as Wilkins will heave one up. And that will do it. So Northern Arizona with the win improves to 16 and 17 overall. And the swarm will fall to 12 and 24. And 
seven and nine here at home in the field house. 38 points for Cat Barber led the way for Greensboro. The swarm came from 10 down in the first. They came back from 12 in the fourth to cut it to two, but in the end, it was too much by the Suns. Our final here from the field house, Suns over the swarm, 125 to 120 as Greensboro falls to 12 and 24 on the season. 125, 120, our final for our entire crew here in Greensboro. Good night from the Fieldhouse.